no matter what. Hey, we both have extra pierce armor armor on our camels. Or, well, I don't. I mean, on our uh, light cav line. He has pierce on his camels. Make a round of shocks either. <laughs> I don't know about that. Regular items can place both players in the same op? Really? Yeah, I've never seen that. I thought that they had it in the map pool as well. That's really weird. I mean, maybe they should just uh, code it so that it doesn't do that. Forty percent of the time, really. I like you like Acropolis. I like Acropolis as well. I think that's a pretty solid map. Okay. Uh -huh. Let me click a vill. I'm gonna just take the forward wood, just cause it doesn't look like I have wood anywhere else. There might be a wood line here, but I just don't have it scouted. I need to take wood. Oh, there it is. Beautiful. All right. Let's go scout the opponents. I'm going to have to bring in a boar. Uh, it's going to be late now, isn't it? Uh, I don't need two. Actually, I do need two because I need the house. Oh no, it's it's on time. Perfect. Beautiful. Perfect timing. Got my two. Oh no no. Oh, good thing these things can tank a hit. Turks, you don't really have to worry about the enemy TC as much. To get the extra pierce armor. A uh, brief intro of what I'm doing and the resources. Yeah, we're gonna be trying to get up to Feudal Age on 21 population, go for a single archery range to make a few archers. If he wants to go scout cavalry, I'll add a few um, spearmen in there. And then I will go up to the castle age, make a castle forward, make a siege workshop forward, make battering rams and janissaries while building a few TCs at home. That's sort of the strategy, but it depends on what the opponent does as well. Uh, I do have actually some YouTube content that We'll go over the the absolute basics. If you if you really like, don't even know what wood is. You don't even know what the resources are. Um, yeah, I have some scripted videos on my YouTube for that, where I go more in depth. But don't jerk Turks just archer feudal archers. Uh, I don't know what you mean. I am going for some feudal archers. Oh, oh, yeah, you mean, like, yeah, no, no, they upgrade to crossbow. They just don't get arbalists. Let's see. Turks, they actually have full upgrades from the blacksmith. So they're really just missing arb. They have thumb ring, even. Yeah. Okie dokie. I need to get some wood happening. Let's 
It's the water stuff on the tech tree app. Uh, it's probably like fishing traps and also gill nets. Fish traps and gill nets and then also deep fish. Deep fish and shore fish gather at different rates as well. So it, it just makes it like confusing for no reason. Oof! <laughs> that was a huge hit. There goes 30 HP. There goes another three. <laughs> nice. Oh, oh, like for the ratings. Yeah, yeah, I don't play water maps, so I didn't actually... I didn't do... Or I didn't add them to the tech tree. It would kind of complicate the page as well. Like, it, it doesn't really need to be there, because... Yeah, I just don't really play water maps. So I didn't add it. How do you know what to do with the, with the Indians on the water map? Well, most people just don't really play water maps, so... Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> there... It's just that every unit comes out of the dock. And there's only really three units that you can build. So it just becomes kind of boring. Or at least there's not as much uh, that you can do on water maps. Most people don't play water maps. It's true. I mean, maybe they're forced to play water maps sometimes. Water game design is just poor. Yeah. Oh, he got a gate? He got a gate? Okay, I, he's actually full walled. All right. Let me show you why getting a gate is not a good idea. In just a sec here. Oh, that lag. When someone ages up, it kind of lags out the game a little bit. Get it, let's get it. This is This is gonna be sketchy though. In ter like my economy is really weak right now. If he takes me off of food, it's gonna suck. Okay, we're getting the market next. And I'm just gonna buy all the resources that I need. Because I'm Turks. There's a few sieves that you can do this with. Turks are like the most questionable one to do them with. Like, it works, but the question is, is it actually good? I think it's okay. Who's idle? I don't know. Get it. Oh! You built two... Two of those. Wow. Okay, well, actually, we're gonna... We're gonna go out. We're gonna go here. He might actually be barricading up his gate. Because he knows it's the weak point. Yeah. Oh. Well, I'll fix it later. Oh. Stop this. Oh, he's gonna lose it. Yeah. Oh yeah, see look, he barricaded it up. Um, gates have less pierce armor than regular palisade walls. He knew that I was going archers because he had his scout in my base. Oh, I forgot to click fletching. That's really bad. Not having fletching for this. Well, I wasn't gonna get a kill. I would have weakened the dudes for later. Whatever. What can you do? He has fletching. Oh, that wood line is actually really bad.
But yeah, he's just going skirms, which is fine. It's gonna make his uptime quite a bit slower than mine. At least it should. Although he is Indian, so he gets the cheaper bills. No! Oh, I was being so good about moving my scout, but... Finally forgot about him. Wait. Okay, yeah. Oh no, I shot it! Ah! Well, I wasn't gonna get any kills anyways, but... Oh, he actually went armor as well! Wow, okay. Well, I think we stop with the archers then. If you're gonna get a gate, get it like... Get it like this, where there's like stuff in front. Then it's easier to wall behind as well. Ooh! Ooh, that house position is bad. Uh, okay, let's actually go to stone now. I'm gonna run out of berries soon. They'll all go to stone once they're done. Yeah, just this house is actually making them go around. Really weird. And then with the gate, you can even, like, get stuff here as well. You can get it like a house like this, and then on this side. And then it's really easy to wall. Oh! He's gonna trap me. Ooh. Can we get out? That would be good. I probably could have gone up there. Oh, I could have. Well, we're gonna go up with one and more vill than I needed. Oh, actually. Do I even have the food now? Oh, I have to buy more. Wow, actually, building that vill hurt. Because I didn't have the food income anyways. Alright, so if he opens skirms with full upgrades, what we're gonna do is we're gonna get just a single stable. And make a few knights, which will allow me to get a forward castle up. That's the idea, anyways. Oh man, the efficiency here is not very good. So, I don't even think I get upgrades for them. Because against feudal skirms, the knights, even up unupgraded, are still going to be okay. They're not great. But they're okay. Getting horse collar here is a bit of a luxury. We'll see if it pays off. Also, even like stone mining upgrade was a bit of a luxury. I, I probably shouldn't have picked that up. Uh, but what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to transfer some of these here now. Because I'm going to have enough. Like, I need to make a couple of knights first before going forward. All right, we'll see if I can get maybe a pick off here. That would be good. He doesn't have any weak bills. Oh, almost. Okay, he for later those two bills they're weak, so we'll remember that for later. Okay, we're gonna get crossbowman and bodkin arrow and knights. Um, I'm actually gonna sell a bit of stone here. And buy a bit more food, just so I can get the wood tech as well. So now, we're going to go forward with some vills. And I'm going to, so basically I have I have um, a timing here where I can do damage. And I, I should actually make a few crossbowmen as well, or a few more crossbowmen. So... I would love to pick off some of those skirms. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna put the castle on his main gold. Because cutting off gold from him would be big. So eight eight crossbowmen with bodkin and fletching or sorry, yeah, bodkin and well crossbowman upgrade. Actually do one shot of Vil. So wait a sec. Oh no, I thought that was I thought he was getting a castle, but it's actually a a, uh, a TC. Oh, he's got camels! Okay, this is all gonna be down to the micro. I think I have enough. No, I have enough. Yeah, I totally have enough. He has extra pierce, though. Not like that. Oh, yeah. No, 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 we're good. 
That bill. Oh, no, no, no. I thought I had the rally set for it or something. Okay. Oh, can I actually? Okay. Next up is going to be. Okay, I think he's going to my base, actually. Oh, no, 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 no. Three HP. Oh, he got me on the hill because he has Bodkin. Large play. All right, so the the reason I wanted a castle forward is because that will support my my battering rams. And another side effect of that castle is that I can build Janissaries from it. And Janissaries kill Mangonels, which is mainly what's going to be killing your rams. So if you have the option to make Janissaries, then you're in a good spot. Uh, what if? Actually, eh, I have, I have this crossbowman. Let's just put the crossbowman there. Okay, I knew he was coming here. So, I was keeping my eyes peeled for that. So he actually just got this TC, and now it's just getting killed. So that's good. He's getting killed by a bear, which is nice. And, okay. Why don't we send all of these cavalry units back? No, actually, no. We want rams. And you can keep out non-ranged units really easily. Well, not easily, I guess. You can say it requires a bit of attention, but if you just wall behind, one villager is enough to do it. Um, so I'm not actually gonna go in quite yet. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring these vills forward and Well, we're gonna have enough stone to get another castle So while we're building up ram numbers Instead of sending the rams into the main TC first we're gonna prepare a castle that should be in range of the TC. And it's in a spot where I can sort of go this way as well. Which is why I built it there. I could have maybe built it a little bit higher up. But I didn't really want to go too crazy there. Alright. So, oh, he might have actually gotten away. Whatever. So now the TC is going to be up. Now we can actually, you can actually put units in rams. Which, uh, oh, this guy's getting so blocked. You can actually put Vills in Rams, even. So you can actually repair a little bit easier. So that's actually what I'm going to do. Is I'm going to put some Vills in a Ram. I'm going to take his main gold now. And he's going to lose another TC. If he has Mangonels, this is what the Janissaries are for. Is to kill Mangonels. There we go. Yep, see? He's going Mango. So now we just click that on there. And guess what? I have 8 range. And you be dead. Okay, we need to fall back now. But that's why I had the castle. And I got these guys from earlier. And I think I just actually have enough now. But Janissaries are pretty high, high damage. It doesn't matter, really, that he has extra pierce armor. Look at these guys. Oh, I didn't even have my cavalry in, in position. Look at that. His, his mango's gonna die to Janissaries. Oh, that was a big hit. We're ramming down farms. You know it's a good game when you ram down farms. And there we go. That's... Yeah, see, without the support for the rams, he's actually taking them out with vills, because vills are actually pretty good at killing rams. Oh, it's so close. It's so close. Oh, he's out of he's out of wood. He can't repair. I think he had just enough wood. He had just enough wood to get a bit of repairs done. But he's going to lose vills, because... Guess what? 
TC only has six range. Janissaries have eight range. And he's got no TCs, so... Or, well, maybe maybe he expanded and I'm not paying attention, just like the previous game. But anyways. I probably could have pulled back the Rams a little bit. Like, I should pull them back here. Or I should pull this guy back. Because then he can't kill it. Oh! Yeah, he's got no more wood. I'm just pulling back. The crossbows are a little bit more, like... They, they do their damage faster, so they can kind of pick off what the Janissaries miss. Um, and anyways, that was the plan, and it was executed fairly well. Where are my repairs? Yeah, exactly! Okay, that's, that's actually what I was missing there, is if I had sent these guys, instead of literally just floating a thousand gold, I could have had them with the previous rams, and they would have been able to repair. Oh yeah, he had a bit of an expansion here. I uh, make it look so easy. Well, I had a well thought out plan, so I was behind in Vils, but it didn't matter because I had two castles in his base and a bunch of shooter boys. Indian camels can 